Welcome to TPM's 3 Minute Thursday. Today we'll check out a tool that automates the interlocking features between bodies. Some common places you might use this lip and groove feature are when splitting apart for rapid prototyping so that you can fit pieces onto a build platform, or plastic part design uh, where things are split into multiple pieces that need to snap together for assembly purposes. Instead of a simple flat region, an interlocking design ensures strength and helps you align components at the joint. In prototyping, it provides more surface area for adhesion. Now that we understand where to use this tool, let's take a look at how it's used. My example remote control is already separated into two bodies by using the split feature. The lip and groove is launched from the fastening features section. Notice some of the other great time-saving tools like the snap hooks and mounting bosses that go along with this great feature. Initially when launching, the dialog is very simple, just asking for body selections of the groove where material will be removed and the lip where material will be added. You'll then define the direction for the feature. This can be the flat face or plane at the split or an edge that goes away from the plane can also be used. Next, we select the faces and edges where we want the features to be applied. If you've got tangency or gaps along the edge for things like snaps, there's options to continue along without manually selecting every edge. With those items selected, we can now see a preview of our result. The next step is to use the great visual with input parameters to define the shape of our feature. We can add clearance, we can add draft, and we can adjust all the different parameters to get the exact geometry we need. We can also link together values that should match between the lip and the groove. And finally, notice at the bottom, we can even save our setup for future use using favorites options. Well, that's it for the setup. I'll apply the feature and we'll take a look at the resulting geometry using tab to hide one body at a time, shift tab to show. We'll also take a look at a section view which shows the resulting geometry pretty clearly. And of course, this geometry updates nicely with design changes. So with a single lip and groove feature, I've created some great geometry to secure my parts with a strong joint. And this time-saving feature can be saved in favorites to be reused anytime. Thanks for watching TPM's 3 Minute Thursday.